In this video, I'll be sharing a maths strategy that you can follow to get a good score in your CDS written examination. And before I start the video, let me give you a brief introduction of mine. I'm Ravind Singh and I cleared CDS 2 2022 and CDS 1 2023 and CDS 2 2023 written examination. In this particular video, I'll be telling you the maths strategy for CDS written examination. And if you want me to make video on English strategy for CDS examination, then comment down, I'll be making a video on that. So without talking much, let's begin with the video. We can divide the whole preparation in three broad parts. And the first one of them is clearing the basics. And in this part of clearing the basics, there comes three things, offline batches, online courses, and study material. You can join an offline batch in your vicinity, or you can buy an online course according to your suitability. And if you ask for my advice, I suggest you to join an online course. Because in offline batches, you have to regularly go there in the offline classes. And if you leave some classes, then you'll be lagging behind of others. Joining online courses also saves a lot of your time and keeps you away from the distraction that are usually in their offline batches. And if you ask for books, then I won't say you need any book or else. You just need to go through the whole syllabus which is taught on your online classes and just make your handwritten notes every day. And in this way, you have to complete your syllabus as soon as possible. And in order to complete your syllabus more faster than others, you can join even a VOD batch where you'll have all the videos in your hands at the same time. You can revise them, you can read them anytime that you want. And when once you've completed your syllabus, there comes the second part that is revision. And for revision, you must not see your videos again. You just go through your handwritten notes. And when once you have completed your syllabus and revised it for two or three times, then there comes the third part that is giving mock tests. And for giving mock tests, you can either buy some model papers from the bookstore or you can use the test book app, the link of which is given in the description of the video. And if you ask, what did I do? I didn't buy any model paper from the market. I just used the test book app all the time. So these are the three things that I focused on while I was preparing for the CDS written examination. And I'm sure if you also follow all these three things talked about in this video, then you can also clear your CDS written examination even in your very first attempt as I did. And if you want me to make videos on other topics, whatever you want, then comment down the topic and I'll be making a video on that particular video. If you like the video and the information being shared here, then you must subscribe to our channel and like the video because this is the only way that you can show your love for me.